back after the uh, scan. It was a full scan. Scanned about um, 60,000 items. Uh, looks like three items are requiring my attention. Uh, looks like it wants to fix some adware, so I'm going to say go ahead and fix it. Unfortunately, it says it cannot remove this adware.mirror. It says remove failed. It cannot be removed from an unsupported file. Okay, whatever that means. Um, if I was just a regular user, I would, I guess, pretty much ignore that. There's not much else you can say. It just can't remove it, it says. Um, on some of these other ones, um, it's removed. Uh, Quite a quite a bit of Trojans here. Um, some of them it uh, says fully resolved, and then it says restart required. Um, that's you know a lot of a lot of different anti malware packages um, delete um, malware upon startup. So it wants me to reboot basically. So I'll go ahead and do that. Go ahead and close it. So it says your system still has items that require attention. And if yeah, there's not much all I can do. It says it can't remove them. So I'm going to go ahead and restart. And I'm not going to pause the video because I don't think it's breaking it up anymore. So just hang on a second. PC is uh, almost fully booted here. I'll go ahead and log in as soon as my screen appears. Um, so we're left with this one error. Um, I'm not sure what it is. It says the application or DLL Windows System 32 WowFX is not a valid Windows image. I suppose you could repair XP and get rid of this, but that's beyond this review. A whole lot of these things. So basically anything anything that requires user init is gonna hit wow effects. Take a little while to start up. So, you know, as a regular user, I'd still have to probably hire outside help to uh, get rid of this wow effects error. You know, nobody's going to know what to do on that one unless you have a consultant come in and help you out. Okay, uh, Norton's given us the green light. Very clean system tray, no crazy um, fake antivirus alerts, no rogue antivirus. Norton got rid of that. So got to hand it to him there. Um, anything I click on, I get that wow effects. Uh, that wow effects error. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and reset my Internet Explorer. I do all the time. Um, just go to my programs, go to add-ons. There's a lot of junky add-ons that 
that were loaded in here, so we make sure they're gone. Add-ons currently loaded. And, and these are um, some of the adware that uh, that Norton has failed to remove. You can see that's Vundu. That's a contextual advertising program. I don't know what that is. I don't know what that is. If I don't disable those, and I do a search for like antivirus, I should see some pop-ups at some point here. If I want to go to semantech.com, eh, it lets me go there. Let's go to Google and search for like online dating or something like that. This is what I get. I try to go to match.com and instead I get mate one. You know, meet our local singles, whatever. So I just got redirected and now I'm getting redirected to. I saw ser search daily come up there. So, you know, uh, it's a typical thing. Lots of adware still on the PC. And, um,. And I'm not, I'm not like uh, saying that, that you know, oh, this is an anti antivirus package, and it only, it, it should only get rid of um, viruses. Well, when you go to a store and you buy these things, they tell you what it gets rid of. It gets rid of adware, spyware, you know, um, key loggers, uh, trojans, all that stuff. If these guys would just say, we get rid of virus, viruses, and trojan downloaders. And we get rid of some adware, just a little bit of it. Then that's okay, but you can't tell people that you get rid of all this stuff. And then they sit there and they trounce your product saying, well, your product sucks. Well, you know, that's all in the advertising of the product. They sh the, the people who advertise the product sh these products should not say they can do something when they can't. So, anyway, uh, the PC runs fine. It's pretty quick and responsive now. But it left behind adware, like all of them do, except for the spyware doctor with antivirus. It, it's gotten rid of almost all the adware. Not all of it, but, you know, I'd say about 95% of it in my experience. So um, That's about it. The PC is running okay. It's running, you know, 95% idle. I've got 300 megs of RAM left. You know, Norton Antivirus 2008 did a lot better than some of the other ones, but again, you know, just typical that they leave the adware behind. So, anyway, I'm just rambling, so I'm going to cut it off here. Um, decent program, just, you know, like everybody else, just get rid of the adware. That, that, that's really plaguing people right now. Adware, get rid of it. So, see ya.